Welcome to my kitchen. Today I will be making a slow cooker pot roast with carrots and potatoes. So I have a two pound beef boneless chuck roast. And then I have two teaspoons of onion powder, two teaspoons of garlic powder, one teaspoon of salt, and a half a teaspoon of black pepper. I'm just going to mix that all together. And I'm just going to sprinkle it on my roast and rub it all in, top, bottom, and sides. Okay, once that is all seasoned, I have two tablespoons of olive oil in a skillet. Just going to put my roast in there and let it brown on the bottom, top, and all sides. Okay, once your roast is browned on all sides, just going to remove that, put it on a clean plate. And then I have one onion that I've chopped up. Just going to put that right in that pan and let those brown for two to three minutes. Okay, once your onions are soft and slightly brown, I'm going to add three quarters of a cup of beef, beef broth. One tablespoon of Worcestershire sauce. Two tablespoons of tomato paste. One tablespoon of brown sugar and one tablespoon of honey. And mix that all together and just bring that up to a simmer. Once that comes to a simmer and everything is all combined, I'm going to add one tablespoon of cornstarch that I've mixed with two tablespoons of cold water. And you want to make sure you get all your lumps out. And then I'm just going to pour that in there. Let it come back up to a simmer. And it will thicken a little bit. And just let that simmer for about a minute or two just keep stirring it you want to make sure that the cornstarch mixture is all combined okay once that has thickened i'm going to take my roast and put that in the bottom of the crock pot And then I have some potatoes. I have three potatoes that I've cut up. Just going to put those around the roast. And then I have some baby carrots. And then my sauce. And just put that around. And then I'm going to let this cook on high for four to five hours. You could also do it on low for six to eight hours. At the three hour mark, I am going to add just a little bit of ketchup to the top of this. So I'll be back and show you what it looks like. 
Okay, it's been about four and a half hours and our roast is done. Just going to try to take it out. It's probably going to fall apart. It's falling off the bone. This is super easy to make. And if you didn't want to brown the roast before you don't have to but it does give it a lot more flavor if you do but if you're in a hurry and you just want to put it in just season it and put it in with all the other ingredients i hope you give this a try please like share and subscribe that would help me out a great deal and i will see you on the next one